All right, what's good everyone? Johan here to bring you a Legendary Hero banner reaction video. I don't usually get to do these because I'm always at work uh, during the updates, but here we are. Uh, it's a Sunday. So uh, before I start the video, I have no idea who it is. I was able to close my eyes or like <clears throat> not see who was on the thumbnail. So yeah, uh, my predictions are either Alin my main predictions are Alincia or uh, Robin. So yeah, I guess we'll get right into it here. Uh, let me close my eyes and make sure I click the video correctly. Okay, here we go. Close my eyes. And it's gonna be... Corrit! Oh my, really? I thought it was just gonna be water. She's Dragonstone again? Really? No freaking Yado. Oh, we're on Japanese. Whoops. Uh, my bad. We'll switch over once, uh... We'll finish this. Another Dragonstone Corrin. Wow. Okay, Sig Trick is... My friend Sig Trick. <laughs> he's gonna be very... Happy and sad. Because I don't think he's been preparing to save for her. Too much. Okay. Yeah. I guess no Omega Yato yet. I guess Melkorn will get it then. Alright, let's see who else is on here. We knew we know about most of them. The blue's gonna be the colorless is gonna be super good. Who's our third blue? Oh Nils? Alright, blue's not that great anymore. Colorless is definitely gonna be the winner here. Oh, okay, we got Rinka and Fallen Nike. Fallen Nike's already back. Okay, so I think colorless is the winner here, and followed by blue, and then uh, red, probably. Green sucks kind of hard. <laughs> okay, uh, let's switch over to uh, the English one, just for you guys. Uh, you, though, if you're watching, you probably already know. Uh, okay. Let's skip over to the skills. I saw Distant Counter and Joint Drive Attack. Okay, so we got Primordial Breath, Accelerates, Killer Weapon, If Foes Ranged, uh, yeah, there's the Dragon Breath stuff, all Adaptive Damage, I mean. If Foe Initiates Combat, or If Foe's HP is equal to 100% at the start of combat, grants 5 all stats, so so this, um, and grants units and a Breath Effect. Oh, heavy, it's a heavy blade effect without the condition, without that attack condition. Okay, not too bad. What's negating Fang though? Reduce damage from foe's attack by 30%, so Ice Mirror for everything. After triggering, boost damage for units next attack by 30% of unit attack. Okay, so it's basically damage reduction plus uh, <clears throat> Draconic Aura put in one. Okay, Distant Counter Shield Pulse, okay. This is kind of like a, a boosted Fjorm, basically. Joint Drive Attack. Okay, she's actually pretty tame, honestly. Uh, she was an infantry dragon, right? Double check on that. Yeah, infantry. Okay, yeah, she's actually not that great. <laughs> um, comparatively speaking to like the likes of Krom and stuff. Very tame. Mostly enemy phase orientated. Uh, I guess she can be player phase because it's... If foe's HP is also at 100%, but she has distant counter shield pulse, so it's like, and negating thing. So mostly enemy phase out of the box. So she's not going to be much of a threat in arena. Uh, yeah, I'm kind of underwhelmed, honestly, not going to lie. So, all right. Yeah, really surprised she doesn't have the auto. Every female Corrin has been uh, either Tome or Dragonstone. The one tome we got was freaking summer, so that doesn't really count. Okay. And... Yeah, let me double check this. So we have... Colorless and Blue are definitely the winners here because you get not only a really strong pair-up legendary, but also an offensive mythic hero in Mila and Naga. Um, Blue also has Nils, which is not the greatest pickup, in my opinion. Um, why, whereas Colorless is Bramimon. So Colorless is the clear winner, I'm pretty sure. Um, and Bramimon's like the premier 
defense mythic right now. Um, after that, it's definitely red. Well, hold on. Well, hmm. So red has two water legendaries who are both kind of meh, but Fallen Ike, who's incredibly strong. Whereas green has two separate elements legendaries plus Rinka. Um, I guess value-wise, green is technically on top, but red has better fodder. It has DC, attack speed solo, and everything. Fault repel and darting breath, whereas green has uh, just DC, wrath, and distant foil. So, yeah, it depends how you see it. Uh, but yeah, all right, cool. We were, uh, I was expecting Corrin. Corrin was like my third guest probably, but I... I didn't, I kind of put her on, uh, on the bench because I expected her to be water. But, oops, excuse that. Okay, really cool. Sanchez did the yard again, it looks like. Yep. Really cool. Uh, I dig it. But I personally will not be pulling on the spanner because I am saving up for my Micaiah and Mia. So, yeah, I'm about at 700-something uh, orbs, so pretty good. All right, so let me know what you think about the spanner. Um, it was a long time coming on it, so we haven't gotten a female corn in a bit, I want to say. I guess, well, I guess it was last year we got fallen corn, but yeah. All right, well, uh, let me know how you feel. Leave a like, comment, whatever, all that stuff. And I'll see you next time. Peace.